<laughs> All right, guys, uh, today is April 18th, which is National Columnist Day. So in honor of that, we are actually going to take a look back, back at some of Danny's tweets during Trevor's time on the Mets. And Trevor, we're going to give you a chance to react. So this is back August 21st, 2022. Danny says Trevor May can no longer be used in the late innings until he proves he can get big outs. All right, the second one. This one is from September 20th, 2022. And this says, as I was saying earlier, Trevor May stuff is filthy, would help Mets fans if he made things a tad less interesting, but he's got the good. So we see a little turn here, Trevor. We're now hopping on the Trevor May bandwagon. And the last one from October 2nd, 2022. Obviously, Mets should have just started Trevor May. Uh, so Trevor, what do you think of this? And we were talking in our, our pre-show meeting, I was saying we have to get his reaction to Danny's tweets. So what are your thoughts? Uh, you know, in, in Danny's defense, those things were probably very true on those days. <laughs> and that, that's very much how uh, how baseball works. But it's funny. I've, I've seen that first one. Uh, I, believe it or not, I got tagged in it a few times because people loved watching <laughs> me uh, react not a <laughs> or hop in the conversation or self-deprecate or something. But uh, yeah, it's 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 one pretty much hundred percent of the time valid criticism, but uh, you know, I'm glad that two of the three are positive. And uh, if you get two or three tweets positive about you when you're a player, that's a win. That's a big win. Danny, how are you feeling about this? Are, were you cringing at us? No, I mean, how are you feeling over there? <laughs> this, is, this is all, this is all public stuff. Um, not going to go back and delete stuff. I don't think the first one, like the negative one was really even that bad. You know, Trevor was going through a bit of a rough stretch. Um, you know, I'm, I was pretty much always on the Trevor, the Trevor bandwagon. Um, obviously dude had filthy stuff. Um, so yeah, he was going through a little bit of a rough patch there in 2022. But, you know, overall, his, his tenure as a Met was really, was really, really good. And the, the tweets reflect that for the most part. I actually love that we're doing this right now. Like this, I'm eating this up. I wish that everyone would do this because everyone loves to get behind, you know, like the, the keyboards and say whatever they want to say. But let's just bring people together, talk it out, and look at us years healthy, later. Healthy discourse. This is really healthy exactly. stuff. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. This is what being a Mets fan, media member, this is, this is what happens.